Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Sarah. I hope you choose to stay a while. If you enjoy the video, please make sure you remember to subscribe, like it, and hit that bell so you get notifications on all upcoming videos. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day. I am. Things are going great. Baby slept last night, so feeling like a much better day. So today we are heading off to Walmart to see what they've got. Um, I've done some more expensive retailers recently, so Torrid and Additional. So I figured we should check out somewhere a little less pricey. Quality might not be the same, but sometimes it, that's not what's important. What's important is just filling that gap of that thing you need. Okay, so that's what we're heading to. I hope you enjoy the try on portion. I am trying something a little bit different today. I'm going to talk throughout the video, so instead of doing the voiceover. So let me know in the comments which one you guys prefer. Do you prefer the afterward voiceover, so I can give you my opinion after the fact? Or do you prefer the, at the moment, first impressions of the garment? And then I'm yeah, so just let me know which one you prefer, and I'll see you guys when we're done with the try on. Alrighty. Alright guys, we're in Walmart. We're going to give some dresses and some t-shirts a try on, see how it goes. I actually did not have to work as hard in Walmart as I did in Additional to find some stuff I like, so we'll see how this goes. First up is this $24 dress in a size 2x. Let's give it a try. Alrighty guys, here's the first uh, dress. It's this really nice burgundy with orange flowers and yellow flowers throughout. I think it's actually pretty cute. It's a decent length, so it's just above my knee. So. Obviously on you ladies who are taller, it's going to be shorter, which I know a lot of ladies like, so that's good. It is long sleeved and it has an elastic at the bottom here of the sleeve, so it keeps it snug on the wrist, but still gives you the billowy kind of arm. So if you have a larger arm also, it's not going to be too snug on there. So for our first piece at Walmart, I think we've done nicely. Alright, so it's got this interesting kind of neckline here. It's a v-neck, but it's kind of gathering. So it's, I think a little stitch here just to keep it closed would be nice. I have it paired with this black belt. I'll show you guys what it looks like without the belt. And once again, just to the knee. I think it's pretty good. Uh, long sleeves, so it's nice for the fall. You don't have to wear an extra sweater. And then once the weather starts to get really cold, a uh, black pea coat would be nice. Let's see what it looks like without the belt. If I can do this one handed. There we go. Oh, and the belt is an XL, and I don't think there's a price on it. But anyway, let's see what it looks like without the belt. So I think it's pretty good. I like it. And for 20 bucks for a dress, hey, can't ask for a heck of a lot more. Next dress is a 2X and $24.97. It is this black uh, v-neck dress with white or grayish flowers through it. Let's go ahead and try it on. All right, here we go with this one. I actually really like the fit of this one. The sleeves are shorter, still long on me, but shorter than the last dress. 
and about the same length. But it fits a bit belly through the tummy here and through the midsection, it's not as tight. And the V-neck doesn't feel like it's exposing everything, which I like. I don't feel like I need to expose everything up here just because. So here we go, let's take a look at it all the way. And there we go, I like it. 25 bucks for a dress. And I can't go wrong. All right, so this one I'm not even sure if it's a dress. I grabbed it in an XL in 29, sorry, 1997. Um, the material is, a bit, is not cotton on this one, and it really doesn't have a lot of shape, so we'll see. I'm not really sure on this, but we'll try. All right, so for this dress, I did check on the material while I was putting it on, and it is a spandex polyester mix, so like 95% polyester. So here it is on. I did put this little wrappy belt on to give it some more shape. I'll show you with it off. It is shorter than the others, but it is a smaller size. Uh, long sleeves, about the same as the last dress we had on as far as length. And it's this dark browny color with black and cream stripes. So let's take this belt off, which is, by the way, a XL again and this one has a price of basically 13 bucks which not bad so here it is without the belt kind of shapeless it does okay it does come in at my waistline here a little bit so it has some definition but just not enough I like I like dresses that show off my curves without having to add belts and all kinds of other stuff to give it shape. I want that built in. But anyway, here it is. It's got some nice movement to it, but really not my style. Not the cut I like around the neck. It's really high for me. I like things that are a little bit lower, but that's just me. All right, so the last dress I have for you is from The Plus, so it's a 2X, 2497. It's like this darker floral print here. It's a silkier material, and it's also 95% span um, polyester with that 5% spandex. Oh, I didn't notice the sleeve before. Let's see how this looks like on. I think I'm gonna like it. All right, so here it is on, so you can see, oops, sorry. Now we can do this. There you go. See the bell sleeve on it. So it's not ridiculous. And the sleeve doesn't come all the way down to my wrist. So it's actually, I really like it. And here we go. It's a deeper scoop, which is nice. And it goes to my knee. So just some really cute fall dresses. Alright guys, and that is all I have for dresses. So let's take a look at what else we got here. Where are we gonna start? I think we're gonna start with this one. And I've got a pair of jeans to go with it. So, just like this dark red, interesting sleeve detail. I grabbed this in a 2X, 2X, and it's 20 bucks. And then the jeans we're gonna try on are more like a legging. This is where I found Walmart kind of slacking. So I grabbed a 24 because I couldn't find many other options. But they're 22 bucks. So I'm more than happy to give it a try at that price point. Alright, so let's look at the thing I like first. <laughs> the shirt. So it is longer, which I don't mind. It's got the side cut on it, so it looks like it should be longer. And then these really cute shoulder details, which I do like. So that's nice. I like the color. So yeah, nothing but good for the shirt. <sighs> the pants. The pants, come on, Walmart. What the heck is this? 
They fit okay, I guess, but there's no pocket. Is there a pocket in the butt? Yes, yeah, so the back has a pocket. But there's nothing in the front. So, and well, typical Sarah fashion. I would definitely need to have them hemmed. I could wear these as socks. Like, they basically cover like a sock does. All right, so I think we're going to move on to the dress pants that we have. And I'll try the rest of the t shirts on that I got with my own regular jeans because just I can't sit in these very long. These ones are a wide leg 2X at $25. So we're going to see how they turn out. They do have pockets. So we've already got a bonus over the jeans. Let's give it a try. All right, so we're going to try this mustard yellow double XL shirt on next. It's kind of like a little mock uh, trail neck. And it's ribbed. I don't know the price because there is no tag on this one. So I will find that for you guys and tag it on at the, oh wait. Found it. $14.97. Alright, let's give it a try. Okay guys, so I like the color. I actually don't mind the fit. It's a little bit tight through here for my personal liking. But it's a decent length. So that's okay. But what is this? I feel, I feel like I'm wearing a balloon on my shoulder. I don't like the sleeve. I thought it might be cute. But it's not. I just do not like it. All right, so let's move on to the pants. They are just a pull-on. They're not bad. They got a nice pocket in them. They are definitely wide-legged. But once again, because I am short, they don't hit me at the right length for what they're trying to be. So I'll just end up passing on these pants and probably this top, even though the price is really good. I just, the more I look at the sleeve, the more I dislike it. The next top we're going to try on though is once again a double XL, this dark red mock turtleneck again. It's got this frilly detail at the collar, at the sleeve, and at the hem. And its price point is also $14.97. So let's try it. Okay, so I definitely like the fit of this one better. It's still tight through here, but it's a better length, so it is shorter. Now, being long sleeve, it is too long on me. See how long it comes across my fingers. But I like the collar. It's not, it doesn't feel like it's choking me, which is always a nice change with something high up on the neck. So, yeah. This one, I, I like it. I like the color, I like the fit. I like basically everything about this. $15. So I actually have a sweater also to show you. It is a XL and $16.97. All right, something I do not understand here, guys, at Walmart, plus size shirts and dresses, I think just dresses, no, I have a shirt. It, their sleeves aren't as long. This is an XL in standard size, and you can barely see my fingertips. I don't understand. Anyways, this sweater is so soft, which is why I grabbed it. <coughs> Sorry guys. It's just so soft, so cozy, it's very warm, which isn't great this right now, because we're still hot. It does have this, um, I'm not even sure what this weave would be called. Somebody let me know what this weave is called down in the comments because I really don't know. It has this turtleneck e type thing going on, but it's not tight, which is nice, but it's not like a full cowl. So, yeah, this is soft. I like it. Oh, so the sides also, they're kind of cut up here like this, which is nice. So, not bad. $17 for a sweater. And it's very cozy. Alrighty guys, we are almost done. We have Guns N' Roses t-shirt next to try on at $15 in XL. So I'm not sure if it's going to work. But heck, it's a Guns N' Roses t-shirt. I have to try it. 
Oh my god, guys, it fits. I love it. Guns and Roses. I am such a hip-hop R&B girl that most of my people who know me would be like, what? What are you talking about? Guns and Roses. I love Guns N' Roses. Slash, oh man. Sleeve's a little wonky, wonky, sorry, wonky. Wonky on the length, but I don't care. I love it. There's this little tiny knot type thing here. I don't know if you can see it, probably not. But, oh, there we go. See it there? I, I love this shirt. Yeah, perfect. Alrighty, so the next shirt is a double XL and $12. It is from the men's department and it is a Jurassic World top. I love this movie. I absolutely love it. I have all of them. Yeah, so let's try it. See how it goes. Alright. Okay, that's better. So, Jurassic World. It's a little long. You can see how low it goes there. If I was to purchase this, purchase this, I would probably go ahead and like cut it so that it was more of a crop length or maybe a little long, long crop. That's probably what I would do. Just because I would probably end up wearing it all bunched up around my waist anyways just for comfort level but yeah i like it especially for the cost price point is awesome thank you walmart all right last shirt i think you're getting a little bit of a sneak peek there this one i'm actually just going to put on for you and we'll go from there okay all right guys hockey season has started if there's ever any doubt i am in toronto i am a toronto maple leaves fan born and bled bred i bleed blue and have for many years. <laughs> All right, so this is a 4X. It is huge. I don't care. It is on sale from $16, which is amazing for merchandise from the Leafs, down to, I don't know if you can see it, nine bucks. Oh, I'm on such a strict budget right now, but I think it's coming home with me. I cannot pass on a Maple Leaf shirt for nine bucks. So that is what I have for you today from Walmart. We'll do the wrap up next and yeah. Alrighty guys, welcome back. I hope you enjoyed the try on portion of the video. As you can see, I did purchase the leaf shirt. So great, it's so comfortable, it's so cozy. Um, great for game day, great for still chilling on the couch with the kids and the husband and watching the leaf game so it's gonna come in handy this season uh, what did you think of Walmart I was definitely impressed I went over thinking you know this is gonna be like a dish now just on the opposite side I'm still not gonna find anything I like and it's gonna be all kinds of older kind of lady clothes they still have that don't get me wrong there's still lots in there that I think my mom would be like, whoop, troop, troop, that's perfect. Sarah, why don't you try this? Yeah, no. But they had a lot of things that I really liked. With Walmart, you've got sizing is kind of wonky, as you guys saw there. I can wear anything from an XL in straight sizes to, depending on the fit, a 2X in plus size or 24 in their denim. We know most retailers at this point, I am a 22, but with the stretchy denim that they had there, and it still wasn't comfortable, I ended up with the 24. So, you know, whatever. Size is just a number. You got to remind yourself of that sometimes. I know sometimes it's hard. But Walmart, thumbs up. Definitely price point is awesome and is accessible to everybody. Not everyone has an additional in their town. Most places don't have toured here in Canada. Um, I know where my mom lives. She doesn't have a Walmart. So she still has to travel two hours to get to a Walmart. But they do ship. So, you know, she has options there. 
my mother-in-law, she's out in British Columbia, and she has very few options. So she's got, I think she was telling me a Paddington's, a Walmart, and um, Reitman's. And that's it. That's all she can get for clothes. So I'm thinking and I'm hoping that for people in those situations, these videos are going to help you guys. So you know approximately what size to be looking for when you go shopping online. Because shopping online is so tough. You might not know the size for that retailer. You don't know how it fits. And then you've wasted, sorry, my hair's just looking really weird. Then you feel like you've wasted money and time getting the item online and shipping it to you and then shipping it back if it didn't fit. It's just such a hassle, which is why I'm trying so hard to focus on places I can go into the store and purchase the items myself that way so that you guys know that you can do it too. You don't have to feel uncomfortable about your body when you're in the store trying on. And if you get weird looks from a salesperson, you know what? I can't say the word I want to say. You know, just whatever. Who cares? Take a friend with you. Take your husband. Take your boyfriend. Take your brother. Take whoever. For that moral support if you need to but don't shy away from going shopping just because some skinny girl may give you a side eye look because they don't think you should be there you know what your money is good as anyone else's go shopping do what you need to do to make yourself feel good about yourself and one of the best ways to do that is by having well-fitting clothes so do you be you be true to yourself do what you gotta do for you Anyways, that's enough rambling from me today. Love you all. Thank you so much for supporting me and being here for this channel. Like I said before, subscribe, like, leave comments below if there's something you want to see more of, less of, what have you. Let me know and I will do my best to oblige. Until the next video, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day.